Well, as some of you might have guessed, I'm rehearsing, trying to learn loads and loads of Yes music for the upcoming ARW tour, the Anderson Rabin Wakeman tour. And I'm so pleased that amongst my rig, I have not one, but two Cronuses, which I love to bits. And also back there in the old uh, rack, there's a nice Triton rack, <coughs> plus a very early X5DR, which I also love to pieces. The great thing about these keyboards, of course, is their versatility and all the things that they can do and their reliability uh, on, on stage and for travelling around. The sounds just get better and better all the time from Korg. I've been associated with the company for 36 years. Yes, I must have met them when I was about five. Yeah, 1980 it was when I... And we've been associated together ever since because I just love everything that Korg put out. Um, as I said about the versatility in sounds, sounds that you couldn't get years ago that just a, a touch of a button you've got now. Uh, that's the great organ sound that I used on um, uh, Heart of the Sunrise. Can you remember the title then? Uh, there's other great sounds, like for example, when we do Close to the Edge, which we're not actually doing on this tour, there's a little insight for you, but the great organ of... That's not the great organ, that is a nice little electric piano. See, I don't even know where anything is. Uh, right, we'll just go back again. That's not an organ. Uh, Eric, is that an organ? It's not, is it? That's an organ. Right, this is the organ which I shall be using uh, for one of the parts of Awaken, um, uh, but was also used on the Close to Edge, which we're not going to play with. sound which you many years ago I used to have to uh, get out my 360 pipe church organ which uh, the technical crew didn't like carrying around uh, so they like this a lot what else have I got on here off the top of my head what am I using that for let's have a little quick look oh this is for part of our new and I But the great thing is, or with all the wonderful sounds that we put together back in the 70s and 80s, you can not just recreate them now, you can actually just take them to another level. And that's what we're trying to do with the Anderson Rabin Wakeman tour, which is take the music, the S music, to another level. Uh, bring it into the 21st century. Um, as each of us managed to make it, we think the music deserves to as well. And so thank you very much to Korg for helping me in my little journey into this part of the 21st century. <laughs>